Wow. So it looks like Joe Button had a brief altercation inside of a club over the weekend. The rapper turned podcaster acknowledged he did get punched in the face, but said it wasn't a big deal. Over the weekend, Joe Button started trending on Twitter after rumors started circulating that he was jumped in the club some supporters by some supporters of Taxstone. But Joe jumped on Instagram Live with Queens Flip from his podcast, who was a co-host on that podcast, to clear the air about the uh, rumor altercation. Um, I saw I saw the tweet like Joe Budden just got jumped. Da da da. Yeah, woke, hey, I got the full story too. Woke up and saw this. He got yeah. jumped. Not well. He got why well, he got his tongue out his mouth. You good? <laughs> That's just gross. like a steel shot. Or <laughs> oh, he is yeah, looking at no, oh okay. shit. What the fuck was that? Oh. Tell y'all about the freaky ass. Joe ain't nigga. never be mad with issues these. now. Oh. That was flip. They said you got no. He don't even want to show his face. Never believe the internet. 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 So 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 when Joe was on Man I was worth a game, Joe Budden called Taxstone a worker. Uh, wait, don't play it yet, Mikey. Right? So Joe Budden called Taxstone a worker. So Taxstone okay. took so Taxstone took issue with this. This is at Barstool too, million dollars worth of game. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. So Taxstone yeah. took issue with Joe Budden calling him a worker. So Taxstone went on Twitter. Was I, I heard? He, he, yeah, yeah, right. From mm -hmm. me saying, you know, bitch ass nigga. You know, big manipulator, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Joe Budden then came on his podcast and, and told Taxstone, suck my dick. So, yeah. so since Joe Budden said those words, suck my dick, Taxstone stopped responding back to, like, Joe Budden. Uh, like, Taxstone hasn't referenced Joe Budden. And and apparently, Taxstone has been sending goons at Joe Budden because, because this is the second altercation that Joe Budden has been involved in in the last 30 days with Taxstone's goons, right? Okay. Now, the man who punched Joe Budden, name is JJ, right? Um, he's 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 a tax stones goon. So, but Joe Budden didn't confirm that. Why do you say that? He came out with it and uh, said he did it. JJ did. Yes. Okay. Oh, JJ. JJ admitted snitched on himself. Okay. Yes. So Frank look, <laughs> Mikey, if you swipe real quick, right? So look, he's wait, no, but, no, Mikey, please, right? So look, you said, <laughs> yeah, but like, yeah. so look. This is he JJ? Said, yes. That's JJ. He's, says, yeah, okay. I beat him like dolo. We, get into these fights. we ain't jump him free tax though. Next slide, Mikey. Then he says, look, so can somebody read that? Because I, I can't read it. When a worker could get a boss touch, touch. Insinuating. That's tough. That's tough. Yeah. Tuck. It's it's tuck. In emojis. Yeah. It's seen oh, way in that Taxstone got Joe Budden touched. Right. Because Joe Budden called Taxstone a worker. Yeah. Next slide, Mikey. That was Who gave you the game though? Rest in peace. Task to suck my dick. Whoa! Yeah, he, he, okay, he, all right, he, easy. Get all the frame. Easy walk. Easy walk. What are you gonna do? Green flip flop. With the leg flip. Task to suck my dick. Whoa! Okay, all right, easy. Don't need. He's sitting like yeah. Tico. Come on. Sitting All right. like Man, Tico. Real quick though. Toes out. <laughs> talking crazy. Little shorts. Yeah. Man, little wide show with your knees out and shit. Oh my god. Come on, gosh. bro. Stop. He's no telling need. someone to Come suck back. your dick. Yeah, stop. Oh, and two. Pause, Come nigga. On, Next time he'll try to send somebody bigger and strong. No need. Wait, he got a mark on his face. He got a mark on his face. It's a it's a mark. Next time he'll try to send somebody bigger and strong. No need. No need for dramatics. Guys, oh and two. Next time he'll try to send somebody bigger and strong. No need. I, I, I pause. No need for. So then, and on Twitter, mm -hmm. my guy called Zip with the drip, who's like Tax Stone's like close homie, uh, and he posted, Tax Stone, call off the wolves. Tax Stone responded back with, I don't know what he's talking about, Zip. You feel me? Of course. As he should. Smart. Right? Yeah, man. Yeah. So, yeah. So, this tax stone beef and Joe Budden beef has now spilled over in, in the streets. Okay. As it should. As it should. Um, as it should. Yeah. So, what do y'all think about now tax stone is crashing out for a second time? I don't think he's actually <clears throat> crashing out. I think that, like, just, you know, like your idol, academics... 
that he talks a lot of shit on these podcasts when people see you in the street like we talked about the last time I was here mm -hmm. it's a different story you can disrespect people all you want in this safe space but if whatever I say here I gotta be prepared to back that shit up in the streets it just is what it is you know what I'm saying people want to be controversial they want to talk they shit they want to get their viral they want to get their clicks they want to tell people to suck their dick and, I'm, yeah. and you a worker and da 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 there's consequences <laughs> for that you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, it is. And the thing about it is that I kind of like it. I ain't going to lie. It's kind of like podcast versus podcast, and it's real shit spilling out because that's how life goes is real shit. It's not just sitting here and talking to a mic. It's being in them streets, too. And you in them streets with people you disrespect, you're going to get slapped up. Yeah, you're going to see. Well, you're going to see people. Yeah, you know, and however, most likely get slapped up. Unless you know how to defend yourself, unless you got security, or unless you got niggas with you, or this is whatnot, a this is whatnot. deep though, right? Because then wasn't Joe Budden on Tax Stone's podcast, and then Tax Stone kicked him off? I would just yes. I right. Would, That's what I'm since saying. Since so then, they goes, made way right. But they got cool but again. Since then, oh yeah, they were cool. They stopped being cool when Joe Budden went on Man I Was Worth a Game and called Tax Stone worker. I, listen, man, okay. like niggas got this weird yeah. thing with the word worker for some reason. Yeah, nigga, like. Uh, but Joe Budden's a worker too. Well, no, yeah, Joe, Joe Budden has had um has had jobs as well. Yeah, yeah. that's what. So like, what? Uh, what well, is that's, the word well, worker? Was what was owner, that? Was, was that he supposed to be owner of State of the Culture at Revolt? Was he an owner of that no. franchise? No, no, right. Okay, but Joe though, mm -hmm. in his statements on Men I Was Worth a Game is mm -hmm. when I was trying to get into podcasting okay. and learn a business. Yeah. I wasn't trying to, trying to like learn from Taxstone. I ain't take no game from Taxstone because my goal was to have a network. Right. So and I can respect that. That yeah. says we can't tell Joe who inspired him. Yeah. So it was again on Gilly. We never look at the instigator in the situation. <laughs> it was on Gilly who kept bringing up the Taxstone. I'm not putting him on my list. So if you ask me who inspired me in the podcast space and you're interviewing me. I'm going to tell you who inspired me. So if I'm not naming Taxstone, you can't force me to name Taxstone. Did Taxstone so, put him on, though? No. He said inspired. Who inspired you in the podcast? And so this, a rapper could give me an opportunity. That don't yeah. mean his music inspired my music or inspired yeah. me to make music or nothing. He just, oh, I know this promoter. He got me a, a He should a get some credit, though. And I think Joe wasn't okay, so trying to give well, Taxstone any when credit. When you ask me that question, who yeah. helps you in this business? Yeah. Then you say Taxstone. You word it right. Yeah. Who inspired you? Yeah. You're going to name the po your Hall of Fame podcasters. But let me tell you why it was, yeah. why it was kind of some shade. Because he could have been like, oh, he didn't inspire me, but shout out to him for you know helping me get in that position. or da -da -da -da. It could have been a better way he, for you to worry instead of being but more... Never so helped him. But the stipulation, the fallacy no. in it, it would he, be... So what, what was the situation with him in the podcast and Taxstone? That's what I, I thought. Uh, Taxstone no, brought no, him on to a podcast. No, 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 no. They were on a podcast together. Yes. No, I don't no, yeah, they were. No, Seven no, years ago or something like yes, that. Yes, right. Yeah. But it was one episode, and um, and it was the Spanish chick from Angela Yee's lip service. Okay. She's the one who okay. who uh told Taxstone, yo, I can get Joe Budden and on your podcast for you. Oh. So at that's the time that Joe Budden was going through the entire situation of him and some girl was accusing him of filming. So They're like, always accusing him. Yeah, right. Yeah. So it was a hot story. Mm -hmm. so, I don't remember this. Yeah, mm -hmm. right. So mm -hmm. Stephanie Santiago yeah. told Tax, yo, Joe, my homie, I can get Joe on the podcast for you. Mm -hmm. Joe came on the podcast. Tax one felt like when Joe Budden was on The Breakfast Club and he was answering those questions more openly and freely. Okay. But now he's on Tax Stone podcast. He's, he's dodging the questions, mm, you know, right? And okay. Tax Stone said, you know, bro, like, I'm not one of those Spanish bitches that you be doing mental gymnastics on. You feel me? Right? Mm. Like, answer the questions. You feel me? And that's why Tax Stone kicked Joe Budden off his podcast. Oh, wow. But, but it was short lived. Yes. <clears throat> okay. But though, Taxo never helped Joe Budden. You feel me? Right, Joe like, Budden was doing media before. Yeah, that, way before that. What's up? Yeah, that was famous. What's, what's up? up? What's, what's, what's up? Really uh -huh. famous. Flacco's favorite girl in the building. Oh, uh, oh, we got some white cool We going We got to jump from Barstool talking right. shit on me. Hell yeah, oh, you, show, you down? That's cool. You down? We beating up these white hoes from Barstool. They talking <laughs> shit on me on Barstool, bro. Talking shit about me and my brother. We gotta beat these hoes up. You down? Okay, bet, bet. We beating these hoes up. So Plan you're free, we coming for your ass, bro. Yo, we coming for your you ass. You know these white people. Kula, tell them. You know these white people calling the police. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. You know. We really just them. we really could just pull up to the HQ. Shit, I know. I know where it's at. I know how to get in. Take your head shot. We really could just pull up to the HQ. Take your head shot so they can put them on the wall. Cause y'all going to jail. 